So we would like to invite the mayor pro tem and ex, uh, let's see, board member of the North Glen Youth uh, Commission, is that right? My paper is out of ink here. So to come up and present the Young Entrepreneur of the Year Award. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Carol. Carol Dodge, by the way. The 2015 Young Entrepreneur of the Year Awards. You will be amazed by the next winner and young entrepreneur that attends the North Glen STEM Magnet Lab School. The winner of the 2015 Young Entrepreneurs Award is presented to Jack Bonneau with Jack Stands. This award honors one student that either lives in North Glen or attends a North Glen school K through 12. The student has demonstrated business entrepreneurism through innovation and vision. My name is Jack Bonneau. I am nine years old and I am a fifth grader at STEM Lab. I'm the founder and CEO of Jack Stands. I have four lemonade stands and I run one and I franchise my other three um, so other kids can sign up and run their own lemonade stand in a farmer's market in Erie, Lafayette, and Louisville. We will provide all the supplies and whoever runs it will get a portion of the profits. My dad gave me the idea of doing a lemonade stand because I'm one of the Lego Death Star which costed $400. I asked my dad if I could get it. He said, sure, but I'd have to pay for it. So I didn't know what I was going to do, so he said, well, why don't you start a lemonade stand? So I did. I got my seed money from my dad for about $1,000. I also got a loan from Young Americans Bank for $5,000 so I could expand my business. I had 46 dates to fill when I first started Jackson, and I didn't know if I was going to um, fill all of them. But if I didn't, I'd be serving a whole lot of lemonade myself. I charge $2.75 per cup for lemonade, iced tea, or an almond palmer. They can pay with cash, credit card, or Bitcoin. In three to five years, I think my business will be me expanding my lemonade stands to about 13 farmers markets so more kids can have the opportunity to learn about financial literacy, business, entrepreneurship, gaining confidence, and making some money and having the fun at the same time. The advice that I would give to other kids who wanted to start their own business was make sure that the business is something that they really want to do and they'll stay committed to and have fun doing it. This has been a fantastic experience for Jack. Jack has hosted over 100 kids through the summer through Jack Stands. So when uh, a new parent and child comes to a Jack Stand, Jack will show them the ropes on how to set up the stand, set up the lemonade, and then Jack will have them count the initial bank, which is what they make change from. At the end of the day, Jack will have them count the ending bank to determine what their sales are. The kids do all their own math, and then Jack works through a, a mini P&L. He accommodates for uh, expenses like sales tax, farmer's market fees, uh, cost of the lemonade, cost of the iced tea, and then based on a sliding scale, Jack will have his own Jack Stands fees. If the family only sells less than 25 uh, cups, then there are no Jack Stands fees because we want to make sure that the kids walk away with some money. If there are fees, then Jack charges an insurance fee, a Jack Stand fee of $10, and then a sliding scale, a percentage of the gross. Typically, they'll walk away with about 30 to $60, depending on how much they sell. Being awarded the Young Entrepreneur Award of North Glen really means a lot to me. I've, I've put a lot of effort into this. I just really am having a good time doing this and knowing that I'm helping other kids um, while I'm doing that is just really awesome and just having a great time. Jack, I have good news for you today. You don't have to go back to school because you're coming home with me because I have two 11-year-olds that need some advice and some, some of your tenacity, as Julie Clark was talking about. So on behalf of the city, we would like to honor and congratulate Jack Bonneau from Jack Stands. Jack Stands. Oh, just love Jack's story. His entrepreneurism, enthusiasm, innovation, vision, and success is invigorating, inspiring, correct? We can't wait to see what you're going to do in the future, and no doubt you are going to do wonderful things. So congratulations. Thank you. You're so welcome. Well, our next award category is for the 